Lightly fried, my delicious halloumi and courgette cakes squeeze every last bit of flavour out of those vegetables. Fill the carrots. Great. Not too finely. You want that nice texture. Next, courgette. The secret is keeping it all grated the same. Put that into a sieve. A sprinkling of salt will draw out liquid from the vegetables. Then grate the halloumi. Halloumi cheese doesn't look that tasty. But once you've got color on it in the pan, it's really, really delicious. Now, really important to squeeze out the excess water from the veg. And you'll see all that water that needs to come out of there. If you didn't do this, it will make your little patties non-friable because the whole thing starts to separate. And then mix in with the cheese. Spring onions, chop up the whites and the greens. Now we're going to season that with some delicious fresh mint and fresh coriander. Whenever it's vegetarian, I like to put a combination of herbs in there. Tarragon and parsley, mint and coriander, basil and lemongrass. All delicious on their own, but in tandem, their flavours play off each other. Next, two eggs in. Give that a little mix. Add the eggs to the mixture. And then finally, a couple of tablespoons of breadcrumbs. The breadcrumbs help dry out any excess moisture. Mix all the ingredients together. Before you start shaping these, Taste the mixture. Mm. It's really important to identify the seasoning now. If you wait until you've cooked them, it'll be too late to adjust the seasoning. Roll them to a large golf ball. Shape them to like a little mini burger. You can spice these up with some chili in there. If you haven't got fresh chili, chili flakes. And it's something that can be done up a day in advance. To get your cakes firm and ready for frying, put them into the fridge uncovered for 25 minutes. Pan on, get that nice and hot. Whilst I'm waiting for that, I'll get the dressing ready. Slice the red chilli, seeds and all, on an angle into shards. Then chop fresh ginger. Season with a sprinkle of sugar and salt. Add some rice wine vinegar. Add a couple of tablespoons of olive oil. To finish off, some chopped coriander. Got that sweet, sour, spicy flavour. With my chilli dressing done, I can start frying off my halloumi cakes in a hot oiled pan. We get that nice, crisp edge. You can already start to smell that sautéed halloumi with the courgettes and carrots. Smells delicious. Really important to put a nice amount of colour on them. After five minutes on a medium heat, my halloumi cakes are ready. So important to have taken out that water. You can see it doesn't disintegrate. And then just get your dressing. Take a spoon of it and then tilt it to the side because I want the garnish. I don't want the juice. And if that does not turn you on to become a vegetarian for the night, I honestly don't know what will. Delicious. My crispy golden halloumi courgette and herb cakes, all of the flavor with none of the meat. Yeah.